Hi everyone, this is Ramakrishna. Welcome to my channel. In this video, I am going to discuss AP Set 2016 Partial Differential Equations, question number 20 from paper 2. And the question is the complete solution of the equation 2x z minus px square minus 2qxy plus pq is equal to 0 with the usual notation is dash. And the four options are option number 1 z plus ay is equal to b into x minus a option number two z plus ay is equal to b into x square plus a square option number three z minus ay is equal to b into x square minus a square and option number four z minus bx is equals to a into a square plus y square okay so here the question is about uh, partial differential equation and clearly this is a non-linear partial differential equation of first order so we have to find the general solution of this uh, equation and we have a uh, charpit method to solve this type of problems so let us see the charpit's method and here we have uh, charpit's method let the partial differential equation be given by f of x comma y comma z comma p comma q is equal to zero let it be equation number one that means a given equation is a function in terms of x y z and p q and here note that notation do z by do x is equal to p and do z by do y is equal to q and since z is a function of x and y so we have dz is equal to do z by do x into dx plus do z by do y into dy okay so that is bz is equal to p into dx plus q into dy let it be question number two and let us suppose that a relation capital f of x comma y comma z comma p comma q is equal to zero exists such that after solving one and three simultaneously for p and q and substituting these values in equation two and equation two becomes uh, integrable then we get the solution of the given problem for that here we have charpitz auxiliary equation and the charpitz auxiliary equation is given by this formula dp by do f by do x plus p into do f by do z and equals to do dq by do f by do y plus q into do f by do z is equal to dx by minus do f by do p which is equal to dy by minus 2f by do q is equal to dz by minus p into do f by do p minus q into do f by do q is equal to d capital f by 0. So this is the Charpet's auxiliary equations uh, formula. So by using this formula we can get the value of p and substituting this value of p in the given equation we can get uh, the general solution of the given differential partial differential equation okay now coming to the problem here the function is here f of x comma y comma z comma p comma q is nothing but given that 2x z minus p x square minus 2 q x y plus pq and that is equal to 0 so this is the uh, given equation say this is uh, some equation number we will put this is as uh, some 4 okay now first we have to find do f by do x value do f by do y value do f by do z value and similarly do f by do p do f by do q first we have to find these values so first we have find do f by do x means uh, partial derivative of f with respect to x so do f by do x is nothing but uh, here this is 2z minus 2p x minus this is uh, 2q y so that is the partial derivative of f with respect to x and similarly do f by do y is equal to partial derivative of f with respect to y so with respect to y means your y term is only minus 2qxy so partial derivative of this term is nothing but minus 2qx okay now we have to find uh, dou f by dou z 
dou f by dou z is equal to partial derivative of f with respect to z so here only one z term we have so partial derivative of this term is uh, with respect to z is 2x okay and similarly dou f by dou p partial derivative of f with respect to p with respect to p means this is uh, minus x square plus q and finally we have to find dou f by dou q value dou f by dou q partial derivative of f with respect to q so that value is given by minus 2xy plus p okay so these are all the values of uh, given function to partial derivatives with respect to x with respect to y with respect to z with respect to p and with respect to q now we have to substitute these values in charpitt's auxiliary equation to get the values of uh, p and uh, q so, so substituting those values in charpitt's auxiliary equation so we have therefore the charpitt's auxiliary equation are given by first one is uh, dp by dou f by dou x plus p into dou f by dou z so that is dp by the value is uh, dou f by dou x means we have uh, 2z minus 2px minus 2qy so this is the value of uh, dou p sorry dou f by dou x plus p into dou f by dou z dou f by dou z value is 2x so this value is equals to p into 2x is equal to dq by dou f by dou y plus q into dou f by dou z so dou f by dou y value is a minus 2qx plus q into dou f by dou z dou f by dou z value is 2x this is 2x is equals to dou x sorry dx by minus dou f by dou p minus dou f by dou p value is minus x square plus q so this value is equal to minus of minus plus x square minus q okay so this is the value of uh, dou f by dou p value and next we have to write dy by minus dou f by dou q so dou f by dou q value is minus 2xy plus p so minus of minus plus 2xy minus p okay so this is the value of dou f by dou q value now finally we have that is equal to dz by q into dou f by dou q that value is uh, given by p x square minus p q plus 2 x y into q minus p q is equal to d capital f by 0 so here we are substituting all the partial derivatives of the given function in charpitt's auxiliary equation is it clear now we will simplify this one so this is uh, dp by this value is given by here plus 2xp minus 2xp will be gets cancelled it is it is equal to 2z minus 2qy is equal to dq by these two terms will be gets cancelled equal to 0 so dx by x square minus q is equal to dy by 2xy minus p is equal to dz by this value is equal to px square plus 2xy q minus pq minus pq minus 2 pq is equal to df by 0 okay now from this uh, second term we get dq is equal to 0 from the second term we get uh, dq is equal to 
0 on integrating dq is equal to 0 implies q is equal to say where a is a a is a arbitrary constant where a is a arbitrary constant therefore substitute q is equal to a in given equation we get that is 2xz minus px square minus 2axy plus pa is equal to 0. So on simplification we get taking 2 as common this is 2 sorry taking 2x as common we get 2x, 2x into z minus ay minus p as common we have uh, this is x square minus a is equals to 0 okay now from this we have to find the p value so p is given by 2x into z minus a y by x square minus a okay now since we have uh, the equation 2 as uh, dz is equal to pdx plus uh, qdy since uh, dz is equal to pdx plus uh, qdy now substituting p value in this equation we get dz is equal to p means uh, 2x into z minus ay by x square minus a into dx plus q means a a into d so this value can be written as dz minus a dy by z minus a y is equal to 2x dx by x square minus a. Now integrating on both sides we get integrating on both sides we get integral dz minus ay by z minus ay is equal to integral 2x dx by x square minus a so that is your integration of this value is equal to log of z minus ay is equal to log of x square minus a plus some constant say log b so here log integration dz minus ay by z minus ay is uh, because here derivative of this function z minus ay is nothing but uh, derivative of z is dz so in the num numerator we have uh, the derivative so it becomes log of z minus ay and similarly this is also log of x square minus uh, a so this can be written as log of z minus ay is equals to so this is of the form log a plus log b so log a b formula so we can write uh, log of b into x square minus a so taking exponentials we get uh, z minus a y is equal to b into x square minus a so this is the required general solution of the given partial differential equation so our option number 3 is uh, correct but here option number 3 is z minus a y is equal to b into x square minus a square so here we have uh, correction so z minus a y is equal to b into x square minus a then it will be the correct option otherwise these four options will be wrong because uh, we got the answer as z minus a y is equal to b into x square minus a so option number three is correct is it clear i hope you like this video if you like the video please share subscribe thanks for watching